Hi guys, it's Susan and I'm here to share with you a quick video on some hair bows that I made for my granddaughter Addison. Um, the first ones are ones that I created for her pictures that I took her recently for and she was wearing a red top and some cute um, denim leggings and um, really really cute and so I thought that I would make her hair bows to match that. She does have some similar, but she, her hair is longer now, and my daughter-in-law wanted to put her in uh, pigtails. And so um, I thought these were cute to put, you know, on both of the ponytails. So let me show you these first. And so they're both the same. And um, I thought they turned out really cute. Um, just super simple use some American crafts ribbon here and this is Hobby Lobby ribbon and then this little flower here came in a double pack from Joann's it was in their um, aisle where their ribbon is and I had bought those a while ago just thinking well I'll use them for something they're so cute and um, they were perfect for this so let me show you I always talk about her and let me show you how cute they were in her hair and then how adorable she is so that's little Addison and um, so yeah she looks really cute with her pigtails and her little bows in her hair and it's funny because when she was little I always put headbands and bows on her and she always tried to tug them out and after a while she would just finally leave them in well, now that she's over two, she loves to wear bows in her hair. She's always picking them out and wanting to wear them. So it's so much fun for me since I had boys. So let me share with you the first Halloween one. I thought this turned out so cute. Um, really super pleased with it. And my daughter-in-law loves it and Addison loves it. She already wore it once. Um, so once I film this, she can have it back. And um, so, yeah, again... Um, use some American Crafts ribbon, some Michaels ribbon, some Hobby Lobby ribbon, and I just thought it turned out cute. Um, for her, obviously, you can see I can't do too big a bows yet, so um, this one looks really cute when she has one ponytail in the back. And then I used some um, orange and purple tulle from Hobby Lobby, and then I used this little um, bat is a felt piece, and I found this at... Um, it's either Michael's or Target. Um, I got felt pieces at both places and I was so happy because I wanted to order some and they're really expensive. So these are all dollar packs. So I thought a dollar for, you get like five or six of them in there. And sometimes, you know, it's a variety, but I just thought it's super cute for Halloween. And then the next one is, um, has the spider ribbon from Hobby Lobby. And so you can see it's got the little spiders. And actually all everything on this boat is from Hobby Lobby, including the center, which is one of their buttons, the little glass rose button. Um, and so I thought it turned out really cute. And I've got some orange and black tulle as well. I'm still definitely practicing and I have a ways to go but they are so much fun and I'm really enjoying making them um, for some of her outfits and just different occasions. So looking forward to making my next one. I've got some really cute turkey ribbon for Thanksgiving. So I'll be sharing that when I get it done. Thanks so much for watching. Have a great day. Bye.